nation rejoice over the Losa celebrations and welcome the Woot Mail Horse Year. Bhutan Broadcasting Service brings to you a special news program on all significant events of the Water Female Snake Year. Good Sangpo and I am Temotsuki. The People's Democratic Party came to power after winning the Bhutan's second parliamentary elections. The People's Democratic Party secured 32 seats out of 47 seats, while the opposition party, the Druk Fensum Sokpa, managed to retain the remaining seats. In what was seen as a close race between Druk Fensum Sokpa and People's Democratic Party, the latter emerged a winner with 32 wins in the polls yesterday. PTP will now form the new government and DPT, after securing only 15 seats, will form the opposition. At the official declaration of the results this morning, the Chief Election Commissioner thanked voters, candidates, party supporters and election officials for the successful conduct of the election. Dashkuzong said it was good indication of the genuine involvement of the electorate and the seriousness and concern with which the people of Bhutan has taken the electoral process to heart. The success of the general election has to be attributed to all the voters who turned out to vote, many traveling for days to do so, parties, candidates who worked hard and participated wholeheartedly to offer a meaningful choice to the electorate, and the entire team of dedicated and fearless election officials, security personnel and polling officers who worked professionally and tirelessly with commitment and enthusiasm in the 47 Demkongs, 20 Zongkaks, and ECB Erohis. The Election Commission would like to thank the spouses and the families of the officials who are associated in conduct of the elections for their ungrudging, for their ungrudging moral, moral support and their contribution to the success of this national event. Of the total 381,790 registered voters, 208,594 votes were cast in person on the electronic voting machines in the 850 polling stations and 44,259 votes through postal ballots. The overall voter turnout in the general election saw an increase of about 11% compared to the primary election concluded in May, which saw only about 55% voters. The primary election had over 211,000 registered voters who exercised their franchises. However, the voter overall turnout this time in general election is a decrease of about 14% as compared to 2008 election, which saw about 80%. Sonok Fonso for PBS News. His Majesty the King conferred Tadakin to the Prime Minister and the Ministers in the Golden Throne Room at Shuzong in the capital on the 27th of July last year. This formally marks the beginning of the new government formed by the People's Democratic Party. The Prime Minister and his cabinet will now officially take charge of the government. They were conferred the Dakin from His Majesty the King. Lynchin Sering Topge, the new Prime Minister, will now take his duty in forging ahead the state affairs. Lunchen Sering Topge, who is also the president of the PDP, was the former opposition leader in the parliament. Home Minister Damsho Doji also served as an opposition member. Prior to joining politics in 2008, he was the attorney general. Doji Chodin, the new minister of works and human settlement, and now the country's first woman minister, worked with the UN Development Programme as the Assistant Resident Representative. The Education Minister Mingbu Dukpa last served as the Managing Director of BBS, 
before he participated in 2008 election. Rinzen Doji, the foreign affairs minister who is from Sarpang, was the former Ha Zongda before he resigned to join PDP for 2013 election. Nima Sangye Tsempo, who is the Minister of Labour and Human Resources, worked in the Education Ministry and in the National Assembly as interpreter. Tandin Wongchuk previously worked as a contractor and also as a people's representative in Wangdi. He will take charge of the Health Ministry as the Minister. Namge Doji, the new Finance Minister from Trongsa Drakten Langtil, earlier contested for PDP in 2008. Previously, he worked with erstwhile Bhutan Development Finance Corporation. D.N. Dungil, who also contested in 2008, is the Minister of Information and Communications. He previously worked as a business entrepreneur and worked abroad for a couple of years. The Economic Affairs Minister, Norbu Wangchuk, served in the civil service and in the private sector. He was also a researcher and consultant before joining the politics. Ishidoji, the Minister of Agriculture and Forest, previously contested in 2008 election with PDP. Prior to that, he worked with the same ministry as a senior planning officer and after 2008, he was with the UN. Following the Dakin, His Majesty the King granted an audience to the Prime Minister, Cabinet Ministers and MP-elects of the ruling government. Dari, jitok nyibigi Tangarakatule <laughs> Hilera, Garigas of Bomberul. Tangajikain de Berusemko Jagobdi, Masugi Lamlunalu, the Sigi Chalazi, the Nadinile, Zaptu Remda, the Rangi Besham, the Sicha Dundere Lound. The Namlu Nitum Gele, the Jor Teperatil, the Namlu Nitum Jusule, the Devedul. Pada two Roda Majese, the Jura. The Ranji give a besham the Laluchi, the same garak, the Laluchi, same sheep, the Deber Omel. Debo the car cheshudi Namra Beru, the Sichadi, Ranji give a long Indera Beru, Machere Mrs. Sukaira, Chimchina gives Sasazumbe, Cham Totobe, Duni Diname, some a car chel. The Masu Lamluki Kole, Dundaji Labajin. The dog, a jamasu lamludi Namlo nitung gelu gutsupil. Gutsup the betotus in Japana, calm mason. In the reberu, my chere rigpa the yunti sap, yum yum lashichir topchil. The talapai, my chere lolly logic the bebesham the, my chere masu lamludi, tepchir a legim the dindi, zonide namasem a carchel, nitung gelu naragi yap. The Maragi Besham, the Gap Yapsinigi, Masu Lamludi, Gutsuk Nail. The Gutsuk de Le, Digi Mugul Kachishudera, the Tari Toro Kokop Top de Lu, Maracatule Tesusum Jibelabachin. Digi Mugul Kachisho, Cheshudera, Chimgi Ringluk, the Totishimda, the Latin, Junjung Lakedin, Junjung Lakedin Litin Dibe, Machera Chala Kajira, Zero, Chada Chorime, but Tansigi Tole. Chapuni, Gakabgi, Tadin Zo Tendi, Gelion Mugilsu Tendrup, Ju Tanjulu, Machere Mesesu, Mount Pagi Cablo, Nera Toto, Gatoto, Kitonto, the Dindibe, Jani Dil. The Narege, Jantono Lutabo, the Melashi Chigira, Gapi Absinigi, the Sura, the Development, Masu Lamlu, the Nopti. Gapi Absinigi, the Machi Mrs. Lucera Venana Mise. The Tarikoko top the Maracatule Labovel. The Gapi Absinigi, Sir a member Besham da. The Machira Gakup, Tapjira Dindizonigi, Gankadi, Machira 
Mesitulu Nanamil. Theta Matsu Lamlu, Gikablu. The Matsu Lamlu Soda, the Tigi, Kor Lentang de Madobe, number not so with the Temel. Laluchiki, the Kor Lemdalu, the Matsu Lamlu Soda, the Mara, Imiti Im Memiti Mem, the Tandiver Lavil. Mila Luchigi di Matsu Lamlu Soda, the Jeben Lalugi Bunten, Lalugi Shooten, Lalugi Cutten, Lalugi Jutten Shimda, the Kaja Babajin, the Rangi Japju Pimigi, Sudden Topper the Gaha Tobajin, the Dalapa Guzundi, the Tim the Matuba Beshimda, Kachira Beru, the Topse, License Beru Top, Tona Beru, the Gutung. Kogabdu, Hama Matomiti, Tarinaba Tong, Lalujigi, Pjebojin, the Shiopji Bojin, the Konejingi, Sago Yuri, Yusichib Nalu, the Rangi Tulam, the Trigdebe Beshimda, the Rangi Sudan Sopo Jabjibji Midi, the Gaha Topdebe Asobojin, the Konejingi Sago Nale, the Kogab Zam Tong, the Papi Gaha Joni, Rangi Chuin Titani, the Longagi Rilu. The Tunlamgi Tolo Beshimda, the Lamsu Deto Tobe, the Kokapsu, Jasha Salebe, Tionse, the Dizumbera, the Laluchigi, the Majera Kaji Miblet and Kayaregi Donka Luchilu Japjuchi, the Ju Tanjulu, Rangi Sudan Sopo, the Pamsi Segale, the Namaseme Dru, Te, Lalung Maeta, the Ani Zumgi, Masugi Lamludi. Majorana do get up no loo, Gora Mogol. Tapa get up Jangala Pato, the Jing Yamba Semidi, Anisuil. That is Zumigi Lamludi. The Major Mount Bogi Cablo, Major Pujigi Cablo, Masu Lamludi, the Nera Totobe, Lejimbe, Tito Bobajin, the Guda, Gulera, Anni Lamludi, Lamlu Yambasu, Major do get up no attention in Mel. Mr. Masu Topogi, the Junjonigi Cock of Top the Loo, the Dalapa Guzundi, gave me the Pamise, Devi member Beshinda, the Lhasa Namda Gitole, Yanka Shubu, the Bagdi, the Migi Masu Lamlu, so the Go Lamda Loo, the Laluchigi Judi, the Nosum Tame do, the Maragi Tawachi, Mr. Masu Topogi. The Tari Jungjonigi Kokop Topda, the Tisukaira Medense, the Vezoni Yupchi, the Chegi Vera Tagol, the Timase, the Torra Talapa Guzundi, Long Magi Nankinalo, Gap Marakatule, Jabju, Matutupi Jul, Major Missigi Katule, Chalu Jabju, Matutupi Yul, the Tizumigi Kokop Zam Topda Lu, Gerab Natsubigi Chalaibel. The Chegi, two Mashua Beshimda, Gade, Tata, Sage Landibe, Cha Shugol. The Kildagi Kable, Mara Dora Jantona Lutonchil. Major Che to Chengi to me, Sugi. The Major Missigi Jaroins. The Major Randin Tadibe, the Nalujama Toto Me. Major Juno Lonche Mogo, Minta Me Mogo, Kone Mishu. The cha shuniki cock up jina, the dinamachin, the dalapa, two mashobe, gade, tata, zagendi, majera missa the gak up to cha shunse, they will love some other migira toil. Titi, maratawa chinamasa melejimin bell. Indera beru, toto majera maso lamlu di sap bulletin, cut a lap, tatuni de carchel. Majera missa sulu, calapu, the dalapa, long magi nankunalu. Kalang the trick the better beshimda, the major migi tonsa, the che lejimsu, Namra beru, yam chutotobe, Namra beru, major gakabgi, tadundi totin, Namra beru, major misigi redi the samcha, kidu the pendesu, how godibe beshimda, the gade, tata, zagendibe, two mashobe chashugol. The da major gakab, ginetam sutadere berura, the Darinaba 
Machira Tambara Chaji Chuchi Dimbal Chaji Chuchi Chala de Kachel Chaji Chuchi Chala de Legion by Jogobachin the Macheregi Siju the Tintimigi the Mangilse Borchetu to the Gol the Torera Rupi Malamigi Kange Dul Yakabnalu Pule Lenshinda the Talapa Pulese the Segobel the Tugi Jua de Tildalu, the Tabmadu Torosap Temel, Majeregi Najun Sulucho, into the Legion Benangol, Toro Yunti Naba Mitube, Yunti the Tintimigi Loshuma Lajum of Dul, the Tizumbera, the Duchimler of Guzum Dibe, the Majere Missisulu, the Tugi Jua de Tildalu, the Cade Tata Zagan Dibe, Cock up the Jacha Celebe, Zonigi Ganka de Canevo Bombel. The Torera Machera Gakabna Lu Lalu Pa Tonsebna du, Lalu Tromka du, Lalu Tonsebna le Tromka lupu, the Lalu Yaketa, Lalu Yamchuber lu, the Anne Boda, the Machera Gakabdi, the Talapa, the Kade Tata, the Gap the Jung Machera Messe, Yanka Dunderbuck, Tar Dunderbeshu, two Masho Beshin, the Gakabdi Dindi Zosul. They were the Gak of Dindis or the Lu, my dear Mrs. Say Dunder with Dindis or Bill. The Annie Ganka say, the Gaida, the Maragi Melum Top Dibe, Chitok Nibigi, Chetuchengi Tumisulu, Torera, the Neranto to be Citrivil, the Talapai, my dear Tumisuki Beshimda, the Tabmadu Bomshuji, Torotandra Lavajil. Nenegi Ladimel. The Anigi Nenegi Lade, the Gudo Gulera, Sagelandi Beshenda, Chegi Kasubajin. The Machera Gahab, the Missilu, Pen Bomber Ton. The Jujura Marahamal of the Zumberei, Chegibe, Charlie Jimbe Shuachin, the Missa the Gabki, Jabjudi, Tasan Namda Gitole, Shubum Bejul. They were the Major Pendi Jubi Gahab. Me cheering Chunsum, Tapunigi Natam, Major Gelung Mugul, Sacha to the Lasha Tendu Gobu, Chegi, Major Migi Donkara, two shows of Tonora, two show de Selabniki Ganka de, the Miss the Gap, the Jora Tepe Pobil, Tatari, Gender Madogi, Tende Tibi Boda, the Maragi Katule. Lunchin Sabda Majeregi Lumpul Hensok the Chetu Chengi Tumi Kairalu the Tashidele the Chica the Majere Missisule the Maragepe Dubdalu the Chashui Cup Namra Beru Madu Mate Namra Beru Majere Missi the Gahab Gitadun Totun Dube Again, the very Chashuil, Chashudalu, Tu Atara, Machera Pam Gejule Guzung, Alupusuchile Guzung, Kairagi, Japjoda, Lote Bomb, Jimidulu, Hilera, Karigasu Bomberuil, the Talapara Berura, Machera, Chisoki Tumida, Kairagi, the Hassan Nanda Gitole, Cha Shun Segi, Kalatam Jil. After the audience, the members of the new ruling government, along with His Majesty the King, attended the Jigden Wangchu prayers conducted by Jung Drasam. Kampal Fusonam Funso, Tanen Funso BBS News. The first session of the second parliament began on 11th of September last year amidst a traditional chitral ceremony. His Majesty the King and Gilchin graced the opening ceremony. His Majesty the King and the Galtin were received in a traditional chiptral procession. His Majesty the King was received by the Speaker of the National Assembly, the Prime Minister, the Opposition Leader, the National Council Chairperson, Cabinet Ministers and Members of the Parliament. 
In the opening remarks, the speaker Jimmy Zampo expressed gratitude to His Majesty the King for the support to the family members of the victims who died in an explosion in Ha. The Prime Minister opened his statement by thanking His Majesty the King for his guidance, benevolence and steadfast support in the democratic process. Nation also thanked the Hmong body, armed forces and every citizen for supporting the elections. The Prime Minister also thanked His Majesty the King for offering sympathy to the families and the loved ones of the victims of the army personnel who died in an explosion at the ammunition disposal site in Ha. Danja Kamchika, Sane Halu, Nacharegi Tensung Mamigi, Chala, Ka Chetokto Zenamdalu, Loburgi Keng and Tendigi Be, Tuken Jusigi Sagonalu, Tutelera Nacharegi, Myong Ada Remoche Cho, Jen Nandigi Be, Tuken Letendigi, Nepsu, Myong Ada Remoche Koragi, Danzi Zenandi, Menchu Legend Be, Zenai, Tigi Masse, Tuken Jugi Sagonalu, Nacharegi Tensung, Mamisu, Shiken Jumisugi, Mijada Gesasu, Lejimbe, Zenamika, Nyamgibasugi, Amsuda Alusu, Sasasugi Tenlu, Tu Sei Sura da Kidu, Matutube, Namle Tendi, Korasugi, Miss Lejimbe, John Subigi, Doctor Su Nami Dilu, Nacha Jumi Yongi Hontole, Myonga de Mochelu, Hing Tamikilera, Kariche, Sushuni. Tangachere Myonga de Remochegi, Chachuk Sembi, Yamsinchevi, Zeja Dizum, Jeodalu. Talefa, Nacharegi, Takasungi, Mami Sugi. Gekapki Sunchogi Chala Zebdalu. Nyankachengi Chala Zebdalu. Koragi Solu, Parche Kadichibe, Judo Zumchibuachen. Koragi Sasa, Kagi Danzi Beongas. Koragi Alusu. Pechatasuga, the Sage Lamungova, Chashuni, Chashusuni, Me, the Shunila. Lynch also said the exemplary relationship that exists between Bhutan and India is due to wise and able leadership of the successive kings. Jaga, Junda Chika, the Tundi Beshimle, Nacharegi Gakabgi, Tenlu Jabjur, Borchetobe, Nain, the Shuni. Chaji Chuvigil Hanju, Saya. Sumtong Gubjada, Chaji Chuchibigi Tundale, Saya, Tonta Ship Chushenga, Macharegi, Gekabgi, Penjur, Yarge, Tanigi, Lerimgi Tundale, Saya, Nga, Yongdom, Saya, Tonta, Napchunga, Ji, Tinachi Gekablu, Torambe, Chinibe, Ta Chemi di To Tora, Macharegi, Myong, other remote Chogi, the Lamten Zam, Namli Tendi in Sashuni. The opening session was also graced by their Royal Highnesses, the Prince and the Princesses, senior government officials and the international dignitaries. The discussion on the agenda formally begins from tomorrow with a motion to restructure the committees and election of committee members. Pemoski for BBS News. Later in the afternoon, His Majesty the King graced the opening session of the National Council. His Majesty the King was received by the chairperson and the members of the National Council. This ceremony began with the offering of Shudral Finsum Sokpa, followed by Marchang ceremony. In the opening remarks, His Majesty the King spoke on the importance of building a better and stronger nation for the future generations. Rikpa Saab, the Nyam Nyong, the Kachizum Chichuinga Sewajin, Ngachira, the Ngachiso da Chetu Chengi Tumi Beruda, Jum Beruda, Ngachira Shiop, Takasungi Magde, Chue de Kada, the Ngachira Mise, the Ngachiso da, the Ngachi Mise Sul, Ngachi Dub Sul. Chodruble beru, rikpa le beru, tsela le beru, topshuk ngage, ngaji ki nosom tantang, jawa chulam, tatam si lejum de da, te rangi gekhablu shatatang di, jenda maruji dul. Ta ka chishu chishu di, chaka tsu da machugi memba beshim da, ti be mabegi kheba jimbal. Ta talapa guzung di be, 
Tangachi Chudubdi Tejenda Madobedu Takachishidera Machiragi Chudubdi Yuki Dibe Rangi Gehab Lushasa Tutube Chashunidi Kache Zitebe Nomel. His Majesty the King reminded the councillors of their responsibilities. The Bechop the Machop Tup Matup Lejim the Sop Randin the Machiragab Gitadin. The Tisule Jimbe Yopchugol. The Timase Majeregi Natsodigi Jaway Lamluse, the Danze Tabugulu Majera Mountbagi Gerabgi Dundele, Kachesu Chesudi, the Gabler Guzung, Majera Bianca Chetjingi Tumi, Gaira Konejeje Bendigi. The Chesam di Machigi Beratungobel. The Talapara Berura, the Machiriki Geo Sodigi Tumisugi Damsi Zambigulu. The Tikagi Jamji member Besham, the Kada Lab, Ta Tungo, the Lab the Zumbe, the Kade Jada, the Long Nagi Rilu, the Machimigi Tonsara, the Cha Shubera, the Tasakion Noigi, Rao the Melomul. Meanwhile, the chairperson of the National Council, Sonam Kinga, highlighted some of the issues that will be deliberated in the session. The chairperson said, apart from other issues, the House will focus on the 11th five-year plan. The chairperson Chada Churi Meba, Yet some Dembegi Tsijito, Zegobig Delu, Heme Shungi, Demkong Gompel Nanjin, Lalen Tamikole, Sijib Onzingi, Sijib Zemi Nijude, Naje Gion Sodi, Shunjo Leden Tsuchungi, Chajib Zemegu, Shishashina, Shungi Mangiljan, Gotam Zedabachin, Tab Deu Madugi, Rikbada Nyamyung, Sijib Nijudi Lenjina, Penlap Chivi, Sunde da Decha, Jun Tsubigirawayul. The ceremony ended by expressing gratitude to His Majesty King for his visionary guidance and support by the chairperson and the council members. Sherab Zangmo for BBS News. His Majesty the King and His Holiness the Che Kempo unveiled the plaque for the Wang Deforan Zone reconstruction project, marking the commencement of the project. The zone, which was built over 300 years ago by Shabdung Ong Namgil, was devastated by fire in June 2012. His Majesty the King and His Holiness the Jekimpo formally marked the beginning of the Wang Difodang Zong reconstruction project. It was also attended by Her Majesty the Gyaltsin, Prime Minister, the Indian Ambassador to Bhutan VP Haran and Cabinet Ministers. Upon the command of His Majesty the King, a prayer ceremony was held for the successful reconstruction works. His Holiness the Jekimpo presided over the Chenrezi Shue Jingse to mark the much-awaited commencement of the reconstruction works of the Zong. Her Majesty the Gyaltsin also handed over a royal edict commanding the immediate release of money to the Zong Reconstruction Committee. His Majesty also granted 30 million nultrum, which was offered by the people in the country and from overseas to the office of the Gyobi Zimbe. Following a 200 million grant from His Majesty in 2012, the Bhutan Broadcasting Service mobilized 65.5 million, the Minister of Finance received over 28 million, and the Wang Dirabdi received 40 million nultrum for the reconstruction of the Zong. The Government of India added a 1 billion grant, bringing the total amount to over 1.3 billion nultrum. The reconstruction of the Zong is expected to be complete by December 2018. The total project cost is 1 billion nultrum, which is funded by the Government of India. The Zong will have modern amenities with adequate safety measures to prevent another disaster, but will preserve the age-old architectural designs. Compile for Karma Sering, Tandem Fenso BBS News. His Majesty the King and Her Majesty the Gelsin visited the capital of Bangladesh, Dhaka, last year. Their Majesty left the country this morning. His Majesty and the Gelson were received at the Hazrat Shah Jalal International Airport by the Foreign Minister of Bangladesh, Dr. Deepu Moni, along with the Bangladesh Ambassador to Bhutan, Imtiaz Ahmed, and other government officials.
The Bhutanese ambassador to Bangladesh, Tashobab Kezang, and officials from the Bhutanese embassy in Dhaka were also present at the reception. In the afternoon, His Majesty granted an audience to Dr. Deepu Muni, the Foreign Minister of Bangladesh. Tomorrow, Their Majesties will visit the Dharma Rajika Bauda Bihar, a Buddhist temple, to pay homage and offer prayers. Their Majesties will also visit ceramic and garment factories, art museum and pharmaceutical industries. Meetings with the Prime Minister Sheikh Hasina and the President of Bangladesh, Mohammad Zilur Rahman, have also been planned. His Majesty will also grant an audience to various Bangladeshi diplomats and intellectuals. His Majesty will also meet with the Bhutanese students in Dhaka. This is His Majesty's first visit to Bangladesh after the royal wedding. His Majesty had visited Dhaka in March 2011 to grace the 40th Independence Day of Bangladesh as a special guest of honour. Their Majesties are accompanied by the Foreign Minister in Charge, Khandu Wangchuk, the Chief Operations Officer of RBA, General Bhattu Tsering, and the Commandant of the RBG, General Dendup Tsering, the Secretary of the Economic Affairs Ministry, Dasha Sonam Tsering, and other officials. At Gunubhavan, the residence of the Prime Minister of Bangladesh, their Majesties were received by the Prime Minister Sheikh Hasina. For the occasion, His Majesty the King and the girls in war, traditional Bangladeshi attire, presented to their Majesties by the Prime Minister Sheikh Hasina. Their Majesties were welcomed with a cultural performance. As an exclusive program, the performers also presented a modern Bhutanese song to their majesties and the gathering. Family members of the Bangladeshi Prime Minister and officials from the Bhutanese delegation and the Bhutanese embassy in Bangladesh also attended the dinner. This is His Majesty's second visit to Bangladesh after coronation. His Majesty visited the country in March 2011 as the guest of honour for the 40th Independence Day celebration of Bangladesh. The Prime Minister of Bangladesh visited Bhutan in November 2011 soon after being elected Prime Minister earlier that year and once again during the 16th SARC summit in 2010. Such visits are seen as a reflection of warm and affectionate nature of the relations between His Majesty the King and the leaders of Bangladesh. Diplomatic relations between Bhutan and Bangladesh was officially established in 1973. Compiled for Sunamongdi, Pamal Hadin for BBS news. At the invitation of the President of India, Dr. Pranab Mukherjee, His Majesty the King and Her Majesty the Gelsin visited the Indian capital Delhi in January this year. Their Majesties returned after a five-day official visit on the 10th of January. His Majesty the King and Her Majesty the Gelsin has arrived in the country after a five-day official visit in the Indian capital Delhi. Upon arrival at the Poro International Airport, His Majesty the King was received by the Prime Minister, Chief Justice, National Assembly Speaker and the Cabinet Ministers. Earlier this morning, His Majesty was seen off from the Indira Gandhi International Airport. While in Delhi, Their Majesties met with the President of India, Dr. Pranab Mukherjee, and held a discussion on issues of mutual interest. Their Majesties expressed their appreciation to the President for inviting them to be the first guests at the refurbished guest wing of the Rashtrapati Bhavan. His Majesty the King also held extensive talks with the Prime Minister of India, Dr. Manmohan Singh. The two leaders exchanged views on bilateral relations and on regional and international issues of mutual interest. 
The Prime Minister of India and other leaders reiterated their full commitment and support to Bhutan's socio-economic development and to further development of Bhutan's hydropower resources. They recalled the strong historical ties of friendship and understanding that exist between the two countries. His Majesty the King conveyed the Bhutanese people's appreciation for the invaluable support and assistance that the Government of India provides to Bhutan. His Majesty granted an audience to the Vice President of India, Mohammad Hamid Ansari, the UPA Chairperson Sonia Gandhi, the Finance Minister P. Chitambaram, the Home Minister Sushil Kumar Shinde, the Minister of External Affairs Salman Khrushchev, the Minister of Commerce and Industry Anand Sharma, the Leader of the Opposition in the Rajya Sabha Arun Jaitley, the National Security Advisor Shiv Shankar Menon, and the Foreign Secretary Sujata Singh. Their Majesties expressed a deep appreciation to the government and the people of India for the warm reception and gracious hospitality extended. The visit reinforced the tradition of regular high-level exchanges and further strengthened the special friendship between the two countries. While in Delhi, Their Majesties visited the famous Mughal Garden of the Rashtrapati Bhavan. Besides roses, the 16-acre presidential garden is home to bougainvillea, tulips, lilies and many more flowers. Pemasuki for BBS News. Eleven armed personnel died in an explosion at the ammunition disposal site in Ha in September last year. Eight were killed on the spot and three succumbed to injuries at the Imtrat Hospital in Ha. Ten others were injured in the accident. The explosion occurred at Anaka in Jenkana. Meanwhile, the deceased were cremated with full military honors. Their outstanding contribution to the nation was remembered during the state funeral in Thimpo. It was a service of thanksgiving as family and friends gathered to cherish their fondest memories of their loved ones. <laughs> Members of the royal family, the Prime Minister, Parliamentarians and the Indian Ambassador to Bhutan, V.P. Haran, were among the hundreds who attended the cremation. Among those who witnessed the final rites were hundreds of army personnel. According to a news release from the Royal Bhutan Army, the next of kin of the deceased soldiers will be entitled to a gratuity of maximum of 900,000 Nultram, group insurance scheme of 100,000 Nultram, Hamchu Sura and Semso of 240,000 Nultram. They are also entitled of terminal benefit of two months salary and leave in cashment, apart from repatriation allowance and Tinkin Sura, the families will also get a monthly pension. Besides other benefits, His Majesty the King also granted 300,000 Nultram each. The next of kin will also receive pay and ration every month as Sura till the deceased attend pensionable age. His Majesty the King will also grant them land 
as Kidu. Kampal for Karmasiring, Tandon Finso BBS News. time ever, hundreds of Bhutanese football enthusiasts got the opportunity to get up close to the FIFA World Cup trophy. The iconic, authentic, solid gold FIFA World Cup arrived in the country on the 20th of December last year as part of the FIFA World Cup trophy tour organized by Coca-Cola with FIFA and the Bhutan Football Federation. The authentic FIFA World Cup trophy, measuring 14.5 inches and weighing more than 6 kilograms, was unveiled by His Royal Highness Prince Jigel Ugyen Wongchuk at the Changlimitang Stadium. The solid 18-carat gold trophy is awarded to the winning nation at every World Cup. The winner retains it until the next World Cup, after which it is replaced by a gold-plated replica. Despite the freezing temperature, hundreds of football enthusiasts lined up outside the Changlimitang Stadium an hour ahead of the viewing of the trophy. What began as an excited crowd soon turned into an unruly mob. The organizers quickly reacted by stopping personalized pictures and instead allowed people to take pictures of the trophy on their mobile phones and cameras. In spite of the momentary hiccup, it was a historic day for football fans as a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity presented itself today. The World Cup trophy arrived from Bangladesh in a chartered plane to Bhutan and was received by the Minister for Economic Affairs, Nobu Wangchuk, and the President of the Bhutan Football Federation, Ogin Sachap Toji. Bhutan is among the 90 countries in the world to host the 2014 FIFA World Cup trophy tour, the trophy's next destination is Nepal. For Karma Sering, Namgizam for BBS News. Well, that was Water Female Snake Year, and let's welcome the Wood Male Horse Year. I'm Pematsuki, wishing you a very prosperous and successful year ahead. Happy Loser and Tashdele.